Hi guys, DG UK here, and I think this will be episode 9 of our UK-inspired rail network. Um, I thought I would sort of begin by showcasing the screenshots. Oh, yeah, move to the right a little bit there. Showcasing the screenshots uh, that I posted a couple of weeks ago uh, of the extra work I put into Bletchley. So basically we added sort of this siding here. Um, this is kind of a, a training center. Apparently, I'm not sure what kind and there was like a small sort of train shed down there. So I put that and I've dropped some Assets there and some silver link services um, Just to make it look a bit busy because I won't have anything running down this this track So I thought I'd just put some assets down and make it a little bit more interesting sort of changed uh, The look of this where there's roads sort of meeting the main part of Bletchley here access to this area um, <clears throat> Shorten this bridge a little bit and I also did some work over here to the uh, industrial sort of area where we can sort of, we've got a couple of freight terminals here in the sheds, which we'll make use of. Um, and I've also done some, put some sidings here that we will also make use of as well. Um, once we've got some services using this line, um, we'll, we'll make use of this. I'm, I'm A question to anybody that does uh, is watching and does play uh, Transport for you too. I'm struggling to find an asset to put on here and um, there's like a, a like a train sort of servicing. I believe it's maybe like a washer or something like that sitting on this. And I'd like to put an asset on that um, just to make it a little bit more interesting, add a little bit more detail. Um, I've put a mod here. The reason why there's so many people here, and I've probably put a mod that's a little bit too... Uh, I probably have to turn down the amount of people that are actually visiting this. I've got a... a, a it's called a pleb magnet. And basically, it's you plop these assets, go to configure here, and you can... Uh, attract of uh, attract uh, industrial uh, sims basically to travel to this point so it's just making use of make making it look a bit more active around here so there are people i guess simulating going backwards and forwards to work so i thought i'd do that um the buses are very very busy i'm hoping the connections for the buses are to the train stations and we can get some people moving around um this is the best sort of replica i could see of bletchley bus station so i thought i'd uh, put that in as well and there is normally a Burger King here. But I've put a McDonald's because I don't have a Burger King... Uh, <clears throat> a Burger King asset, shall I say. Um, so, yeah, I thought I'd add that. I think it looks quite nice. I think it finishes it off as well. As we're going to have services going through here for cab rides, it just adds a bit of detail in. Um, makes it a bit more interesting. I think it's quite nice. I'm quite proud of it, so I thought I'd show it off. As you can see, the Bletchley sidings are in full effect. We've got a couple of services here. Having it taken a rest which is nice, and a couple of silver link services coming up and down the main line there as well. Today, however, I was uh, thinking of um, doing the, what's it, uh, what, what do we call it, uh, the Marston Vale line. So actually making use of this and getting this some services on this line as well, um, and making use of these sidings with those services. So I was thinking of doing Fenny Stratford, and I think it's Bow Brick Hill along here somewhere, just... Uh, here, this the Marston Vale line, I believe, goes all the way to. Uh, let me remember uh, where we go. Woburn Sands, Aspley Guys, Millbrook, Stewart B, Hempstead, Hardwick, and I think we go where did it go? Bedford. Terminates at Bedford, and meets up with the. Uh, I guess it goes over the top of the uh, Midland Maid line as well. So it'd be quite nice. I think we, we'll, we'll, we'll see how far we get. I kind of wanted to make a start of it just to give myself. A sort of, how can I put it, uh, a kind of give yourself a reference point of where this comes along and where maybe I'd put Bedford in the in the future. So I thought I'd do a couple of stations here, add a couple of assets and just get this going. I'll probably keep it this side of the river, although I think this is part of the river I am going to delete. Yes, it is. So we will be deleting that river or slowly covering it up as we go along anyway. This is a small sort of replica of um, the best I could find for a football stadium of the MK Don Stadium in Bletchley. It still needs a bit of work around it. I'm I'm sort of filming an R in because I don't want to go too... I don't want to detail too far away from the railway lines because you won't really see it anyway on the cab rides. But it was just kind of, you know, what I view as you're going past. You can sort of see that in the distance. But I might add a few bits and bobs around there just to finish it off a little bit. And especially if we're coming past here, um, we've got some houses and a bit more industrial uh, park and shops along these either side of these two. Uh, that's the best I could find for a giant sort of... Um, shopping center which there is kind of a a mini sort of shopping center there which also takes uh 
freight goods as well. So we can sort of link this to this uh, this area here, get maybe freight delivered in here and get it sent to this as well. It should be quite nice, I thought. Um, anyway, let's make a start on uh, our first station then and crack on with this time lapse.
Lovely. So what I'm going to do, yeah, so that's some houses. Maybe send the canal up a little bit more. Reconnect some of these rows. Reconnect the A5. I'm going to have to swing that around there. Might add sort of Coldicott Lakes. We're a little bit racist. We would be able to see it. A little bit of scenery. And I'll add some services to this as well and see how it goes. Um, so what I'm going to have to do is add some sort of quick turnaround here um, for the trains. But we'll add some services. Add some uh, houses, some businesses, and get the, uh, get the line going and see how it goes. And then what we'll do is... Next episode, I'm not really sure what I want to do, really. I might carry on with this one or I might get head back down to London because I keep meaning to as well because I keep meaning to sort of add maybe a little bit more London Underground or something and get London moving a little bit as well. Uh, but we'll have a think about that. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. I really appreciate it. Just a little one today, but I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you again.